Today on Real Conversations with Nicole, we are going to be talking about handwriting and preschoolers. Just recently, I was doing a professional development workshop with a group of preschool teachers and this question came up and I had to share it with you because it was so valuable to the team that I was talking to and I think it's going to be so valuable for you if you happen to be a preschool teacher and especially if you are a parent of a preschooler. Um, the question was, how do I prepare my early preschoolers? This was a pre-K three, the young ones that would come in two or three times a week. They were not full-time preschoolers. How do I prepare these little ones for handwriting? The answer was, and always will be, while these three-year-olds are in school with you, they are learning so many things. They are learning dress up, body awareness. They are learning body and space. They're learning sharing. They're letting, learning working side by side. They're learning about routine. They're learning about being able to predict all the things that happen in the preschool class, the fine motor skills, the puzzles, the pegs, getting that sensory input into their hands, all the different tool use that they're doing, the shovels, the paintbrush, the chalk, all of those things do not go near a pencil and a paper, but all of those things are very much the building blocks we need our little ones to have so that they can be ready to begin the pre-writing stage. So right now in this three-year-old, early three-year-old class, we do not, we, you probably don't have time, um, and we do not need to worry about a formal handwriting, formal um, writing on a piece of paper and a pencil because all the other things that they're doing, the visual memory, the learning the shapes, the learning the colors, are really preparing them so that when their little hands become ready, they can easily get to what they're doing. So don't skip what happens in this three-year-old stage because it is the foundations for the success that they're gonna have in their late threes, early fours, transitioning them into kindergarten. It happens right now in the late twos, early three-year-old class. All right, friends, I'm Nicole Santa Maria, um, pediatric occupational therapist. Feel free to ask me any questions. You can find me at nicolesantamaria.com. There's a link below this video so that you can get more tips and videos like this straight to your inbox.